Later, and in the run-up to elections, a migrant worker has been shot in Jammu and Kashmir's Anantanag. This was a targeted killing and a targeted attack is what the authorities in Jammu and Kashmir are saying. Search operations are underway in the area. The migrant worker from Bihar was shot by the terrorists in that targeted attack in Jammu and Kashmir. Well, it is the officials there who have gone on to identify him as Raju Shah, who was rushed to a hospital but died during treatment. The attack comes barely a week after a resident of their Radun was shot at by terrorists in South Kashmir last Monday uh, and this is a man who survived the attack but two workers from Punjab had also been shot dead in Srinagar in February and a Pakistan link had emerged later. We have my colleague Nazir joining us to get us more on this. Uh, Nazir, uh, what time did this attack take place? It was a targeted attack. We're talking about a migrant worker hailing uh, from Bihar who was targeted just uh, you know 24 hours before elections began. Well, an innocent man, a defenseless man who has come here to pick out living for his family was targeted. Yesterday evening in a village called Jablipura in Bijbihara of Anatnag district. This is clearly an attempt to create fear but a killing an innocent man. Uh, Raju Shah was critically injured. He was shifted to hospital where doctors declared him broad dead. This incident has happened when the security hosts have largely contained and eliminated militancy from the valley. And I can tell you the security force feel battle how can this incident happen when there is no local recruitment in militancy, when there is not infiltration and all these things happen. And this is after a long time we see this is rather second such incident in the valley in, recent, in, in this uh, major incident where innocent man has been killed. These things had become a you know frequent attacks on the migrant workers, but more often than not, security hosts have always you know actually killed those who were behind these uh, you know attacks, target attacks, or uh, tracked them down, arrested them. And police are saying soon after the incident they launched a cordon search operation, but it appears the attackers may have managed to escape. But police are confident that, that the attacker will be tracked down sooner than later. Uh, so this incident has also happened at a time when the uh, Anatnag is there are high political activities. Mahbub Mukti is today filing a nomination papers. So is Mia Altaf of National Conference. He is also filing his uh, you know nomination papers. Umar Abdullah is also addressing a rally in Anatnag after his candidate files nomination papers. So a lot of political activities and ahead of these activities we see this innocent man, defenseless man, being targeted by terrorists.